Welcome everyone, Mike with Bowers Barbecue coming to you today from Amarillo, Texas. Really excited to bring you this video. We're at Tyler's Barbecue. Uh, for those of you who have followed me since my blogging days, this is actually the very first barbecue restaurant that I, I blogged at. So I'm really excited to come back and film it for you. But first, we gotta start the fire. Yeah, check this three meat plate out. This is ridiculous. We got brisket, we got ribs, we got house-made jalapeno cheddar sausage, some potato salad and beans. I cannot wait. All right, we got our meat here. This is amazing. Three meat plate is a ton of food, a ton of food. Check out this brisket. Check it out. Nice, tender, smells delicious. That's smoky, tender, this is good brisket. This isn't the traditional, I don't even call it traditional, the cracked barbecue yet. This is old school barbecue and it's damn good. This is such a nice change of pace. I've been this side about brisket a long time. Holy cow. I can't remember the last time I've dug in a brisket like this before. See, my wife wants to try a bite. See what you think. Pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, that's awesome. House made jalapeno cheddar. Check this out. Excellent texture. For you hunters out there, if you ever get your deer processed and get that jalapeno cheddar sausage or jalapeno cheddar like smoked sausage, very, very similar texture to this. Man, this is good. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Really appreciate that. If you want to see more content like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It really means the world to me. All right. Let's dig into some of these ribs. Nice spare, good smoke ring. Very sweet, very tender. I am in love. Hello, interruption. This place is pet friendly. Good to know Tyler's built a big patio. Absolutely amazing. You can bring your dog out here. Dogs can't come inside, but outside it's fine. They also have little tabs uh, connected to the picnic tables. So you can put your dog's leash on. This is absolutely perfect. We're on a road trip. So we, we brought our dog. We're gonna have him here at the cabin on our way to the mountains. Being able to bring him and get some delicious barbecue 75 degrees, late July in Amarillo, Texas. Great experience. All right, let's dig in these sides. Creamy potato salad. It's got that baked potato, mashed potato consistency that I love. Pickle, celery, perfect refreshing crunch. I like that potato salad. I am loving my meal. This is the third time that I've been to Tyler's and absolutely the best. These beans. Oh my God. Those beans. Perfectly tender. A little kick to them. Man. This is good barbecue. This is proof that you don't pay attention to a list. Lists are fun. Don't get me wrong. But Tyler has been on the top 50 list, didn't make it this time, and it's a shame. I'm not going to name names, but I can tell you there's other barbecue joints on the top 50 list that don't come close to what Tyler's putting out here. This is so good. I can't get over this brisket. It's not prime. Um, this is what is close to prime, but not quite there. This is, this is so good. Look at Bart. This looks wet, all, all rub, no sauce. 
Now, if you're coming here, I suggest not buying by the pound. They have two, three, and four meat plates. It's the best bang for your buck. All this food that I had, $25. Unheard of. I can't go to Jersey Mike's for that price. I love this brisket. All right, so we had that three meat plate. Uh, Tyler was generous to bring out some turkey and new sausage for me to try. So we're gonna do that. Check out this turkey. He said he brined it for six hours before smoking. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> I was right to grab that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome turkey. All right, next up we're gonna try this uh, chili cheese sausage. This looks pretty good here. You know what Tyler told me? It tastes like a chili dog. <laughs> Absolutely like right. Dog. Tastes like a chili dog. Really Almost forgot. I'll try some sauce for you guys. I already put it on here. You all can see my daughter over here. She's dancing. She's so excited with all this. <laughs> She's like, I haven't had barbecue made me dance in a long time. It does. It makes you want to move. The sauce is um, tomato based, sweet, a little smoke to it too. I, I love that. And, if I had to compare this place to anybody, well, this used to be the Norman barbecue, but now it's kind of all the same. But it's just got that backyard environment, S similar to Snows. I'm not saying this place is Snows as far as environment goes. Food-wise, probably a little bit better. Um, and I hate comparing people like that. It's, that. it's in the same category, is what I'm trying to say here. Um, good barbecue, it's not too heavy, not too rich, because not smothered in tallow. It's just good eating barbecue. It's, I can't say enough great things about this. Maybe I am, I'm burned out on the craft barbecue scene, who knows? But this has been a change of pace that I've absolutely loved and uh, feel like a little fanboy right now for Tyler's because this is absolutely amazing. All right, we're gonna finish this up. I'll be back with a recap, but you guys know how I feel. So three people ate that three meat plate, we're pretty full. They have sheet cake. And I like cake, not that. <laughs> so we're gonna try that. I said so this is banana, they were out of chocolate. This is amazing. Zoe, let me know what you think. You like it, huh? It's pretty good. Yeah, the banana flavor is very pronounced. It's, um, good icing, thick, dense cake. That was worth it. So that, that was a great meal. I, I can't get over that. I think the brisket was my absolute favorite. Paired with that, um, the beans and the potato salad is like summertime barbecue, exactly what I needed. Uh, this was amazing. Uh, the dessert, stunning as well. So for three people, we ate for $30. You cannot beat that. That is an absolute steal when it comes to barbecue. Yeah, I, I can't wait to come back. Um, I think this will be a, a mainstay every time we come to the mountains. Um, thank you so much for watching the end. I appreciate each and every one of you. Until the next video, the fire is out.